Okay, so they've put um, Deontay Wilder. This is Jack Dempsey versus uh, Jess Willard by the looks of it. It's just some copyright-free boxing for you all to watch whilst we discuss old Wilder and where he's going with his life after getting uh, handed it to him by Parker. Um, that's harsh. Fans argue over De Deontay Wilder's new ranking in Ring Magazine. Um... So in the top 10, as uh, Alexander Usyk, Tyson Fury claim the top, uh, and AJ, blah, 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 you know the normal spiel. So basically, in the two main events, Parker outbox Wilder for the f uh, wide unanimous decision, and Anthony Joshua outboxed uh, Walleen. Uh, this has led to AJ leapfrogging the American and taking his number two. Okay, so Wilder, so the, so the Ring magazine now, the Ring magazine... Um, Order of boxers is uh, Usyk, obviously champion. Okay, um, so first, but it's kind of second, but it's not. It is first. So the first um, is Tyson Fury, then Anthony Joshua, then Zili Zhong, um, then Joseph Parker is number four. So he's obviously come up. I don't know what he was before. Uh, Philip Hergovic, uh, Frank Sanchez, which I really like. I think he's a very, I think he's amazing. Um, Jar Jared Anderson, sorry, uh, Joe Joyce, and then Deontay Wilder at number nine, and then uh, Ajit Kabayel. So Kabayel put on a better performance than Wilder. So, <clears throat> you know, the point being is people are saying this is unfair, okay? Um, if I'm honest with you, I've never liked Wilder. I don't think he's got enough tools in the shed to be a heavyweight. I don't. Don't get me wrong. I mean, he he was world champion at one point. I can't remember what belt he held. Um, but I, I've never really understood why there's so much hype around him. Look, every heavyweight boxer can knock you out. I don't get what the what the big deal is. Boxing isn't about power. Yeah, this is what I don't understand. Boxing is supposed to be the answer to fighting bigger people than you, essentially. Yeah, like all martial arts are. All martial arts, or boxing, kickboxing, judo, they're all created for one thing, and that is to be able to um, outmaneuver your opponent um, despite size or strength. It's to mitigate the strength of your opponent. Yeah, like you don't learn, you put it this way, you don't learn judo to do beat up kids, do you? You can beat up kids. Why can you beat up kids? Because I'm going to get like completely high, uh, like striked on YouTube. They're like, he's talking about beating up kids. No, why would you be, why would you go into training to beat up a child? Yeah, or so, or let's not take a child out because I don't like the fault of that. But, you know, let, why would you beat up a... Why would you go to training to beat up someone that's clearly at a disadvantage to you? Yeah? You can clearly beat them up without any training. The point being of training is so you're at an advantage against people that are stronger than you, essentially. So, what I don't understand is boxing in itself is trying to solve a problem. And the problem it's trying to solve is that you're going to be better at fighting and uh, knocking people out, essentially, or what, however you want to put it, against people bigger than you, right? So they've all got knockout power. Everyone in boxing has got knockout power. Yeah, it's nothing special, right? That's what I don't get. The po Everyone's got knockout power. We know that, yeah? Don't get me wrong. Not everyone is, um, not everyone is good at knocking out. Not everyone, it comes naturally. Um, blah, blah, blah. You know, the, the genetics of people are different. The mentalities are different. You know, Mayweather in his late day, later days certainly wasn't looking for knockouts, although they did happen. Um, but yeah, he, he was more of a, you know, you know it. You, you, you're into boxing. So not everyone's the same. But Wilder is just known for that. He's basically just known to be this knockout artist that's the greatest knockout artist of our decade, you know what I mean, of our um, era. And I'm just like, that's not, you need to bring more than just that. That's my point, yeah? Everyone's bringing that. Every boxer in the heavyweight division is bringing that. Tyson Fury brings that, but guess what he also brings? Slipping, head movement, yeah? Switches to southpaw. He, he can fight off the ropes. That's what he's bringing, 
Yeah, you sound uh, uh, Usyk, Alexander Usyk. What is he bringing? He's bringing that European in and out style. Yeah, he's very technical. He's got a lot of movement. Yeah, he's quite happy to go twelve rounds with you and pick you apart. That's what he's bringing. Wilder, what is you bring? Knockout power. They've all bringing that. So I've never personally liked him. I, 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 I wouldn't even put him in the top ten if I'm honest with you. So his last four fights, okay. So he, obviously he lost to Parker, unanimous decision. Um, Hellenius he beat. He, he knocked him out in the first round, didn't he? Yeah. Uh, and he's beat uh, Tyson Fury. He's beat him twice. You know. He's 38 now, I believe, Wilder. Um, is it fair for him to be number nine? Um, and, and without a shadow of a doubt, um, number nine is a fair spot for him. He's fought once per year for the last four years. Okay, this year he fought twice. Uh, or when did he fight Hellenius? So he fought Joseph Parker once. So this year he fought uh, once. Okay, last year... He fought once. 2021, he fought once. 2020, he fought once. 2019, he fought twice. See, so in the last five years, uh, no, four years, he's only fought six times. And two of, so what, last four years, whatever, he's fought once a year. He's not an active fighter at all. He's not actually, if anything, let's be honest, he's not in it for the for the championship. Uh, he's not in it for the belts. Uh, he might say he is. He's clearly not. Because if he was, he'd be fighting constantly. He'd be fighting to get back up. He's just going off now. Tyson Fury absolutely destroyed the man. He destroyed his spirit. And I think now he's going off on some spiritual path, like he said, taking Iobrasco or whatever the hell it's called. You know what I mean? He's doing something like that. So, yeah, look, I, I think it's totally fair. I think round, uh, round nine, I think um, I think rank nine is perfect for him. Um I don't, well, if anything, I'd rank him lower. That's that's the honest truth. I don't see what the big deal is around him. But yeah, there you go. I'm sure I'll get some Wilder fan, uh, Wilder fanboys hating me. But there you go. Um, you know, just take it out with Jack Dempsey on your screen if you think you're big enough. Right, have a good day. Oh, Merry Christmas, everyone. I hope everyone had a nice time. And uh, Happy New Year if you're going out um, drinking. Don't fight, though. You know, take it to the ring like real men. Don't do all that silly business with a uh, bit of gear up your nose or whatever it is. You know what I mean? I don't know exactly what you're thinking. You're out on the razzle with you and uh, you think, oh, I'll have a bit of a row or whatever. Don't do that. Don't do that. You're old. You're too mature for that, mate. Not unless you are 19 and oh, I can't get through to you. Have a good one. Have a good happy new year or whatever it is. Bye-bye.